skippers Johnny Haynes of England on the left and Jose Aguas of Portugal exchanged gifts before the Wembley match, which is to decide whether England get into the last 16 of the World Cup. Portugal wins the toss. For the visitors, anything but an outright win means defeat, because white-shirted England only need a draw to make certain of that ticket to Chile next May and June. An early England push gives the ball to winger Bobby Charlton, who centers to Douglas and Pointer. But Portuguese goalie Pereira holds it. Ray Wilson takes a free kick for England. Johnny Canelli dodges Vicente and shoots, and it's a goal. Only five minutes gone, and England are one ahead. Portugal tried to hit back. Outside right, Joker centers into the English penalty area, but skipper Aguas heads it wide, and Wilson clears. England again. Ray Pointer has a chance and scores. Unlucky hero of the rest of the match is Portugal's teenage wonder boy, Francesco Eusebio, who makes an awful lot of trouble for goalie Ron Springer. All right that time, but here they come again. Johnny Haynes decides it's time the other goalie had some work. He passes to Bobby Charlton. But Pereira isn't letting any more through, and at half-time, it's still 2-0. Second half, with Portugal renewing the pressure. But England's goal has two mighty defenders. One is Ron Springett, and the other is the thickness of the post. And now the game's a seesaw, with the English goal under attack one moment, and then the ball's on its way to the other end. Ray Pointer worrying Pereira again, but not all that much. England looks safe for this match, but some people are beginning to think they'll have to do better next summer if they hope to get anywhere near that World Cup. The plucky Portuguese have more goalpost trouble, but they keep fighting. So does Ron Springett. There's the whistle, and England are in the last 16. Further outlook, Chile.